been eight months since Aini vaccinated her daughter. Prior to the COVID-19 pandemic, routine immunization was mandatory in her household. But she says her fear of the virus has stopped her from visiting clinics or hospitals for months. I know immunization is very important, but what can we do when the situation is like this? There is a pandemic going on. I am very worried about the safety of my child if we go for immunization. And my husband forbid us to go get vaccinated. So that's why our daughter didn't go. Aini says Indonesia's increasing number of COVID-19 cases makes her feel uncomfortable. There should be an announcement or counseling from the government about the importance of immunization in the middle of this COVID-19 situation, so parents will be informed about it. We don't have any information. Schools just give us forms to sign for immunization, so I'm very worried about that. Almost one-third of Indonesian parents are worried about taking their children for immunizations during the pandemic. We saw a decrease in our immunization programs beginning in March and throughout May. But even though there is a pandemic going on, mothers should still take their babies and toddlers to the health care center for a proper immunization. We don't want another disease outbreak just because of incomplete immunization. A survey by the health ministry showed that, in addition to parents being concerned, hospital staff in the smaller regions were also hesitant in carrying out these routine vaccinations for fear of contracting the virus. But the challenges go beyond fear as well. Many government hospitals in small villages were forced to shut because of logistical and funding issues. The local government hospitals are the lifeline for residents in villages, especially for children. Right now, the health ministry is providing as much help as we can to prevent the spread of other diseases. We have a campaign that encourages residents to communicate openly with us, and we continue to prioritize educating our citizens on the health protocols. Those measures are important because a government survey earlier in the year found that Indonesian children were more vulnerable to catching COVID-19, resulting in serious complications and even death. Silkina Aluwalia, CGTN, Jakarta.